Yeah. The the one little fire ad was the problem. I think uh, I think I was gonna be okay against the big guy until I got sta stamped in the buttocks with a fire pitchfork twice. We did find like a shortcut, like a sort of shortcut. So that was cool. Uh, like when people play Pokemon emulators, but agree that if a uh, Pokemon dies, it has to stay dead. Oh wow, harsh. You'd have Dean mode where you can't invest in vigor. Damn. Cause yeah, because I kind of understand like my thing where I don't want to just inflate my health bar so that attacks don't matter. But some of the other people, that we have people on YouTube sometimes leave a comment or sometimes in Twitch that say like, oh, uh, why don't you just play at Soul Level 1? And it's like, well, I can't use any of the equipment in the game then. And I'm all for making it difficult, but locking out all the equipment that you can use unless you're level 1 just seems kind of against what I would do with a game. Poor old Tab, how is this game? We obviously hate Bloodborne, what do we feel about this one? Well, this one's amazing. This was worth the 500 on the on the on the PlayStation 5. Like Demon Souls cost me 500 uh, pounds, and it was great so far. I think other than being at a loss for anywhere where I can grind back the health items, because for some reason we still don't have the Estus Flask yet, it's from the future. Uh, that's the only downside. That's it. No having to use some really wonky gun to uh, to win the levels. Yeah, the underpants playthrough. Yeah, I mean, I'm hoping Shadow of the Colossus is good, because then then each of them cost me 250 pounds, which is a little bit better, and a little bit more value. You see that guy? He just walked off the end. It's crazy. This game's kind of interesting because there's a bit of storyline every now and again, and there's a cutscene every now and again. And it's just like, wow, they went all out in this. All right, yeah. The only thing I didn't realize is that my edition that I brought, I brought a disc edition, and it doesn't come with the DLC on the disc. I have to go into the PlayStation Five store and buy some DLC for something that I just brought a hard copy of. <laughs> Kind of annoying. Why would you do that to me, Sony? Nickel and dime me on the DLC. Ooh. Ooh. Plus, plus, the major thing is that. In Demon Souls, because it's a PlayStation 5 game, the rumble on the pad works. Which is which is great. For some reason they haven't hooked up the rumble properly in Bloodborne, which I must I assume is because it's a PS4 game. So it's not properly emulated on the PlayStation 5, and I am disappointed. Yeah, I've never played played it, but Shadow of the Colossus is supposed to be a classic. And it's not available on PC. So I thought, wow, fantastic, why not? Let's bundle this in. Because it like you paid uh four hundred and seventy nine pounds or something or other for the for the PlayStation 5 Slim. And then they give you like a a, a bunch of discount coins that you can only use on their website, you know. Typical mobile game stuff, but on their website for buying it. So I had a, like a load of what was essentially free money to use but in a limited time, and I'm just like, okay, well, one Bloodborne, please, one uh, one voucher for the PlayStation Store for enough to buy um, Demon Souls because they bumped the price up by double overnight for some reason, uh, and Shadow of the Colossus, throw that in there, and then that was all all of my coins used. Yeah. 
So many games I need to go back and play. I was right about the DLC. It was leaked in December, so all those people I've helped since December. I hope they're happy. I bet they are. ICO was the prequel, or at least the game before in the series. I don't know what ICO is. Unless I'm mistaking it, it's just the same studio. <laughs> It's a bit of shorthand I'm not familiar with, ICO. I'm thinking insane clown occupants. Oh, it's not shorthand, it's just ICO. Did you really released a title called ICO? I ICO. Oh, okay. My mistake, sorry. I'm gonna call it Echo. Oh, well, I'll have to check them out if that's a uh, that's a thing. Ooh, got the big guy by himself. Cool. Let's find him over here in the room of doom. The rat cave. We got him just. I didn't do as well this time as I did last time, but then. No fire guy this time, so I'm alive! Hooray! Hooray for Dean! Hooray for Zoidberg! And then we went up here a little bit before. about as far as we've got. I think I died to this second uh, large lad that's up ahead. And that was the end of me trying this thing. Alright, I think this is officially it. I think this is officially new territory. Yeah. 
Ah, oh, this this is all gonna collapse underneath me when I walk on it. No, it's just a fog door of doom. Well, that's good too, isn't it? Can I destroy this? Can I? Can I leave? Oh, here we go. Oh, hell. Oh, maggot water. Oh, maggot man. Oh, God. Who would even? The leech monger. Leeches, not maggots. Okay. <laughs> that ain't no chess, and this ain't Kansas. Uh, hey, hey, buddy, can I kill you with fire? Ah, oh, nasty, nasty, nasty! Well, kinda? <laughs> Sorry. Sorry, anyone in the audience who is a maggot or a leech. Fire, fire, fire! Oh no, he's regenerating health. Like, massively regenerating health. He did not care about the fire. Eep. Wait, where was down? This was down? I'm not sure why I want to go down there. This seems like a bad idea, but let's do it. I didn't mean to set the world on fire. Oof. Okay, good block. Maggots, though. I can't see. Yeah, I got a DOT from all these leeches on me. I'm going to try and roll them off. Oh, it's doing like a regen move. Okay. One, one more. Beach Monkers trophy. Trophy end. Demon vanquished. Body restored. Yeah. It's a good body. Let's restore it. Um, yeah, we did it in one go. Not bad. I think I was supposed to do this earlier, seeing as it was like a, like a bronze platinum trophy, which makes no sense. Yeah. Yeah, uh, yeah I think we did good. Like, discovering that the, the leech is on me, did some damage over time, and not like melting away to it, watching our health bar. I think we were pretty, pretty solid there. 
Sucker stone shards. Yeah. I think um, the other thing is that it's nice that I didn't need to lure the boss to like hit me while I was here to break through this uh, barricade. The problem with Dark Souls 2 is that there's one boss in one arena where like there's an item up in a tree that I can't destroy, but I bet the boss can. Yeah. I thoroughly expect everyone to uh, go over there once that is a thing. I think we all want to know what's coming next in that game. We got the writhing demon soul. Is there any other lootables that I didn't loot in this room? Just, just quickly. Like a bird's eye view. No, I don't think there was anything I failed to loot on the way down. <laughs> Pretty cool. So, this one's listed as the Swamp of Sorrow. Sounds great. Archstone of the Leechmonger Demon. All that is unclean ends up, and ends up in the giant swamp at the base of the Valley of Defilement. The swamp is a cesspool of putrilage, vermin, and plague. I might need that poison ring. But I'm going to try and go without it. Yeah, where, where are, like, the zone of happiness, the town of happiness, the swamp of happiness? You're right. Like, that snow level did not bring me any happiness in, in, in Elden Ring. Like, the outside one, um, not Elden Ring, Dark Souls 2. The snow level on the very outside of Dark Souls 2's Elium Lois, where you're actually out in the snow fog, and there's just horses everywhere. The horses of damnation. That could have been like a snowstorm of happiness, but no. Thou seekest the power of the soul, no? Then touch the demon inside me. Uh, let's give her a, a talking to. See if, like, uh, she says anything new. I keep the candles lit and serve the brave demon slayers who are trapped here. It's not apostrophe D. It's E D. You didn't constrict the word at all. That apostrophe shouldn't be there. I'm mad because she's doing it now. The guy upstairs was the only one doing it before, but now she's doing it. I keep the candles lit and serve ah. the brave. Okay, I got enough for level up. Almost two. Weird how strength is going to give me more damage on my dagger. So Let's go. Why not? No, oh, I am going to do dexterity because I'm trying to transition over to the uh, the scimitar or whatever my other item was. Boom. Done. Art thou finished? May thy strength help the world be mended. Uh, let's see what else we got. There was a new type of stone that I got. Let's have a look at that. Sucker stone shard. Shard of the blood sucking ore clings to skin. Reinforces curved swords, katanas, and the like. Sucker stone abuse weapons with the bloodletting effects. Hello. Weapons can be reinforced by sucker stones up to level 5. Damn. I wish my blacksmith would offer the ability for me to add any of these ores to weapons. He hasn't so far. It's bizarre. I don't understand. But I'll just carry on not understanding. Let's see if the wizard has anything new to say. Or if there's anyone new out here. Hello, wizard. Are you begging for a magic lesson? No. Me? Of course I made my best effort to free Master Freak. But I had not the strength. It's as simple as that. Besides, if I myself were captured, who would stand here and recruit rescuers? This guy's one lazy son of a gun. Could be like Dark Souls 1. But I think the first blacksmith I met had a menu at least for like looking at the other items. Whereas I've met two blacksmiths in this game and they've both just got the generic would you like to upgrade and it uses a different type of stone from this stone. I don't know. I'm sure it'll all come to light as I fumble around in the darkness. Besides, if I myself were captured, 
Who would stand here? I see. Suit yourself. Let's see if the storage man has any new dialogues. <laughs> I ain't gonna murder no one. Maybe. I mean, I killed Patches yesterday, so that was good. Hello again. I'm keeping a close watch on your belongings, don't you worry. I mean, he did tell me to look off of the cliff again. So, I wasn't falling for that. For a f fifth time. Four's my limit. <laughs> Saints, sages, and all manner of wise men watch over the halls of this nexus. This rejuvenating sanctum is a fine place for the slayers of demons to rest their weary bones. I too must contribute how I can, for we are indebted to our honourable defenders. Honourable defenders like me! Yay! I'm appreciated. In my time. I too must contribute how I can, for we are indebted. You have a heart of gold. So, I guess there's everybody interesting that I know of. Well, I, I guess we'll talk to this guy. I, I doubt he has anything new to say, though. But perhaps our age will see the... Nope. Right. Let's see what's... um. This is an awful lot of souls. No, I'll do. I'll do, like, one, one, one money run and, like, buy a proper level up. I mean, hopefully, as long as I don't mess it up and die. It's kind of helpful that I found out where you can get some, some okay money in the game. Should you need more health potions and uh, just short of a level up and, and that kind of thing. I mean, it's, it's kind of awful that I'm doing this rather than just playing straight through, but the, the amount of souls you got in that zone that I was just in, a red form. Whereas this ain't half bad. That was cool. Freezer there missed me with the finger laser, which killed Krillin, so, you know, gotta avoid that finger laser. 22 minutes left. It's a countdown for joy. Well, I hope there's some stuff in there for everyone to be excited. Oh, yeah, you know, I, I never watch anything. On purpose. <laughs> that is the man I am. I need to see it in person. Because I've been disappointed by previews many, many years ago when games either didn't come out entirely or they completely and utterly changed them by the time the actual release version was out. And I'd rather be happy with the version I got than be sad over the version they didn't release or never released. I remember the game Twisted Metal 3 was going to come out and then it was in all the magazines and then they just they never brought it out. It took years before we got another Twisted Metal game and it was called Twisted Metal Black. And it was great, but it wasn't the game that they showed me like a million times before that they just benched. Weird. Thou seekest the then touch the deep soul of the mind key to life's ether. Oh no, I get nothing out of this dexterity level up. Arsh. Let strength be granted so the world might be mended. So the world might be mended. Art thou finished? May thy strength help. Right, then we need to buy some more helix and then I can carry on with the level. I got a strategy. And it's good. I got some coffee. And that's good. Nope, I spoke too soon. My coffee is out of itself, which is a travesty. Time to move on to the colas. Oh, 
Hello. Forty nine health potions. Beautiful. He's gone cold, I'm wondering why I got out of bed at all. Morning rain clouds up my window, but I can't see at all. Very swampy so far, not feeling all that much sorrow yet, but uh, it's early days. The sorrow could literally be anywhere. a few lights in the darkness down here so it's not all bad is this blight town have i been in blight town all along oh one of the crystal lizards um, 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 I do want you item, but I'm gonna, I'm gonna go for that crystal lizard. Oh. I can't just go across to there. Oh, there's a plank for going backwards. Okay. God. Nasty. This is not my kind of water. Oh, jeez. Um, I guess I had this way. I can't see anything. Game is too dark. Oh god, what's that? There's millions of these things out in the air quotes water. 